What's going on, world? 5150, aka Detroit Dion, here in the house, coming at you live. And today's topic got a, had a had to rethink because I had a phone call with my man Juan today, gentleman's brotherhood, some next level stuff. But team, teamwork, team. Got a team right here. Team, University of Michigan, all about teamwork through everything from the student body to the sports, you name it. But this thing, team, that we look at, acronym like my man Nick Miles put out the other day, together everyone accomplishes more. So what I'm saying, look around you, look at your team. How is your team doing? Are you uplifting your team? Are you taking your team to the next level every day? Are you challenging your team every day? And is your team challenging you every day? Challenges are good. Us as humans, we don't like to be challenged, but enjoy the challenge, enjoy the struggle. Enjoy anything that comes against you that makes you have to exercise patience. Enjoy it. You know, thank God for when someone comes against you and maybe raises your blood pressure, gives you time to exercise patience. I think it was Jim Carrey that says, I have exercised the demons. That's right. But this team thing is real. Look around you. Look at the, look at, look at the players that are around you. You know, I got my man Jay Vladimir. You know, strong motivational player. My man Downtown Paul, strong motivational player. Scott DVD King, I see him out there doing his thing. Strong motivational player. These brothers are out there just making it happen. You need strong people like this around you to keep you pushing forward. You want to make sure that you're constantly raising the bar every single day with your health, with your wealth, with your mind, your body, your spirit. All that is intertwined all together. You know, my mentor always said we have two bank accounts in life. One is our emotional bank account, and then the second one is our financial bank account. And he always says that we'll run out of the emotional bank account first before the financial bank account. So we gotta keep the mind sharp as steel and get around a positive team like right here, the University of Michigan team who are practicing daily, out there sweating, going hard, challenging yourself, challenging each other, just challenging the challenge. Enjoy the journey like I had to tell my man Juan today when we were talking. We have to make sure we're enjoying this journey so we get a team together so we can start delegating stuff, delegating things. I don't need to sign all the checks is what we were talking about. I don't need to sign out for the paper clips. You know, we can delegate stuff. So get around a strong, powerful team and they don't have to actually be like your real team, but this could be friendships, families, motivation people that are just gonna push, push, and push you. There was a great movie I suggested to my man Juan today that someone suggested to me, Moneyball. I'm not a big baseball fan. I'm not even that big of a sports fan. I'm a University of Michigan addict, as you can see, homegrown 313-734, a square all day. That's Ann Arbor, in case you didn't know. But this movie Moneyball, when I sat down and watched it, it opened up my brain to this whole thing. Don't wanna give you too many ideas about the movie if you haven't seen it. But if you're building a team, if you're building something, go check out Moneyball. Very, very interesting theory. Because being a solopreneur can be lonely at times, you know what I mean? So what's better than having a team around you at times just to crack some of that loneliness? But it's good to be alone. We have to be alone with ourselves in order to grow. I believe if you can't enjoy being alone, it could be a, an issue further in life. Which is my opinion. None of this stuff is written down in concrete anywhere as far as I know. But the team, team can build the dream. The team can uplift you. The team can make you happy. The team can make you smile. The team can make you laugh. The team can make you cry. The team can make you throw up your hands in victory. All types of stuff. So cherish your team, put strong people around you, keep it short and sweet today. Go Blue University of Michigan sports are coming back. Big Ten, I heard, is going to be popping off. Ladies and gentlemen, build yourself a power team. Build it. Why not? What have you got to lose? Keep shining, y'all. Peace. Go Blue. And I'm